book came about really because I needed material for children to perform. It's not my fault I was late. It was the snow. Why do people have hairs on their noses? But it wasn't a normal day at all. Me, 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 me. What I'm trying to do is create child characters who are who feel real to the children, who feel very contemporary British. So I did this really fake smile, like this. So I thought, wouldn't it be fun if you had a, a fantasy character who met an ordinary character in an odd situation? Goodness, what big teeth you've got. So Fernspeak is a homegrown festival that we've developed in this school, Fern Hill. And I booted the ball in a huge kick towards the trees. Give your best performance tonight. And then Miss goes, ow, but, and the whole room goes quiet. He had great fun and it built his confidence. It allowed him to express himself and understand how he could work with his voice. We threw all of it, box, bat and card, right up into the air. Children that are naturally timid in class that don't necessarily uh, speak up or they're not really forthcoming with answers, they then tend to build up towards this big performance. And she just zooms like a rocket in big bounds. I think there are some other guinea pigs waiting out there in cages for a signal. You could use the book either in a very ambitious way as we do or you could use it in a smaller way as material that might prompt children's writing. My beak is sharp enough to slice you into neat, yummy, bite-sized pieces. It really helps with the speaking and listening aspect and also the writing. So public speaking um, has definitely improved our writing results over the past years. Grit they crash and crash and wham. Knock down each bit of the school. Then I'll miss that setting. Yippee, now that would be really cool. I think this is just the beginning.